Hey everyone, it is early June. I'm here in Wisconsin on Potato Lake. Fishing with Reggie down there in the boat. My name is Randy, you're watching Go Midwest Fishing. Alright, quick look at Potato Lake. We took the landing right here. Just kind of going, looks like we're heading this way right now. It's not a real deep lake, it's uh, fairly shallow overall. And it's known, uh, especially late in the summer, to get uh, really green, full of algae. So the clarity is not the greatest, but there's supposed to be some trophy muskies in here. And it's actually, people say it's actually a pretty good lake to fish. So Reggie and I are on a our uh, spring fishing trip here. So yesterday we were fishing Chain Lake. It was like 60 degrees, cloudy, rainy. It's just cold today. It's gonna be in the mid 90s, sunny, hot, and windy. So a complete change of weather. We'll see how that affects the fish, but they were biting yesterday on that nice, cool, cloudy day. Right. Little northern. Oh, not bad actually. Green spinner. Oh, oh. <laughs> nice one though. Alright, first one on the boards. Alright, currently in the east bay right there. I'm just a big shallow bay. We don't see too many weeds in here right now. It's kind of lined with lily pads on the outside, but and in the middle I didn't see much for weeds right now anyway. But uh, apparently there's northern here, right? You just caught one. So I'm guessing that dock there belongs to this guy over here. So out in the middle of this bay here, we got this patch of weeds right here. Cause actually we're not finding a whole lot of weeds in here. It's just really thick or just bare ground. Oh, Reggie snagged. Alright, so we're way up on the uh, northeast side of Potato Lake and there's another landing up here. I just wanted to check this out while we're here. It's just kind of a gravel road that ends. So it goes into a private road down there. We'll take a look here. Yeah, just come down this road. And there you go. It's got a dock though. And this is kind of cool. It's like a little dam or something. So it's private. Yeah, a little tiny waterfall. Looks like it just goes into a river. Ooh, it's fish. What is that? We're coming through this little channel here. We saw some bluegills in these lily pads, so we might try to get a couple of those. All right, why don't you troll us through here and we'll catch some bluegills. Holy crap! Is this carp? Must be carp. Oh my gosh, huge carp! Two more up there. Wow, those are huge too. Oh, what is this? Step in the pool. Did. I stepped in horse poop or something. Okay. I stepped in horse poop, I think. Now it's all over the bottom of the boat. Yeah? All right. Oh, it's a bat. A crappie. 
Holy crap! You are the crappie master this week. With two of them. <laughs> All right, picture time. All right. We are up here in Rosie's Bay. Yeah, we thought we were gonna catch a bluegill, and he caught a crappie up here, and we're in Rosie's Bay right off the end of the landing. Water's pretty, uh, pretty murky. It's hard to see much in here, and pretty weedy too. What's going on, with this guy? He about tipped over. He's doing circles out there. I don't know if it was on accident or purpose. It didn't look too good. Heading through the narrows right there. So it goes down into the further narrows and down the south end of the lake. But right here is supposed to be Musky Alley. Right there is Musky Point. So that there is Musky Point. Got some lily pads along there. Looks like there's some sticks coming out of the water over here. It's a Tuesday and there's quite a bit of traffic on this lake. So I'm guessing on weekends it probably gets pretty busy here. That one. What is a big walleye? Get in that, get in that. Huge walleye. Holy crap. Yeah. All right. Like a walleye in the middle of the day. All right, measure you. You are gonna be 20 inches. A beautiful fish, look at that. Nice, all right, let you go. Barely touched the guy. Yeah, right down uh, Musky Point, right down in there. That's where he was. So that was the old uh, Rapala rip stop right there. That's what caught that walleye. It's kind of right out in the open there. There's no weeds, nothing about seven feet deep. It's out in the middle of nowhere. It's not expecting a walleye. <laughs> We're just trolling along here. I got the spidro hooked up there, so I'm sure you'll be seeing that if you haven't already seen the underwater footage there. Hopefully we see something under there. That's kind of murky water, so we may not be able to see very well, but coming up here is called the Narrows, where you go into the uh, south part of the lake. And there's also a resort there called the Narrows. We're actually going to stay there, but they're completely full. Uh, there is a boat landing there. I think it's, I'm not sure if it's just for the resort or if you can use it, but there is one over there. Here's what it looks like. Alright, so there's there's the bridge we got to go under to get to the other part of the lake. That's the narrows there. Scraping ourselves up here. It's eight feet deep, it says. Are we? Is my camera gonna hit? Hopefully not. Oh, 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 oh. Crap. oh yeah, camera scraped by by an inch. <laughs> All right, we're now on the south end of Potato Lake. Just kind of a little round lake back here. And for some reason, it got like twice as windy when we got back here. Taking a look at it though, it's, it's fairly deep in the middle. This is 49 feet, I think. Uh, it's supposed to be good for musking that along that shoreline. So we're just kind of slowly trolling along there. Oh, yes, he's got a bass. We've been wanting one of those. <laughs> And the green spinner, even. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that looks like a, yeah, it looks like a 
cut with a I don't know, tumor growing out of it. All right, you go. Oh, 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 I had a good one on too. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, he broke me off. Just big fish broke me off. <laughs> <laughs> right, you better catch one quick. There, I got one. Hey, crappie. Crappie. What is this? You and the crappies lately. Nice one too. And we do. There's our bluegill. He's all speckled up. Dang, they're loaded in there. Yeah. I'm gonna have some fun. <laughs> I wanna have some fun too. Oh yeah. That's official. A bluegill, a crappie, a largemouth bass, a walleye, and a northern. We're just missing a muskie. All right, it's just getting way too windy out here. We're gonna head in, but we're fishing all kinds of lakes in this area. So if you like this lake, check out uh, the lakes right up here. We just fished a whole bunch and we still got more to go. All right, everyone, we'll see you on the next lake. Thanks for watching.